Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Yasudian, a consultant dermatologist based in the UK. Psoriasis is one of the commonest conditions that we encounter in dermatology and many prefer to use natural forms of treatment for it. Is there any particular advice that we could give to them? There seems to be some evidence that vitamin D helps and this is something I've looked at before. However, there is a further dietary supplement, fish oil, that may have an even better effect, particularly when it is combined with other treatment modalities. Omega-3 fatty acids are present in fish, plants, eggs, and to a certain extent in grass-fed animals as well. Fish, particularly cold water fish such as herring and sardines, are the best source. The specific active molecules of oils of these fish are Icosa pentaenoic acid and Docosa hexaenoic acid. There is some epidemiological evidence for the effectiveness of fish oil as high consumptions of omega-3 fatty acids is found in populations of West African countries and this has been linked to low incidence of psoriasis in that region. Similarly, Eskimos who consume more fish oil than other Europeans have a low incidence of psoriasis. In a review published in the Journal of the American Academy of Dermatology, the authors reviewed the evidence of fish oil supplementation in patients with psoriasis. They identified a total of 15 trials and determined that overall there was moderate evidence of benefit for the use of fish oil supplementation. 12 of the 15 trials showed benefit and 3 trials showed no benefit. This is an image taken from a double blind study where 37% of patients responded to fish oils alone. The dosages of fish oil used in the studies were highly variable. However, in the positive trials that used oral fish oil supplements, the average dose of Icosa pentaenoic acid was 4 grams daily and the average dose of Docosa hexaenoic acid was 2.6 grams a day. In general, the range of improvements with fish oil supplements seen in clinical studies was a 40 to 75 percent reduction in PARSI or psoriasis severity scores. Note, however, that oral fish oil supplements taken on their own need to be used for long periods of time, about six weeks to six months, before any improvement is noted in the psoriasis. Fish oil has also been studied in combination with other therapies. Double-blind studies of fish oil with ultraviolet B phototherapy have shown that it is better than placebo. Open-label studies that have also shown that fish oil is beneficial when combined with topical calciportriol and oral retinoids like acetretin. Support for fish oil supplementation in patients with psoriasis becomes more compelling amongst those at increased risk of myocardial infarction and other cardiac problems. There is insufficient evidence to suggest that fish oil supplementation decreases the risk of coronary heart disease. But there's evidence that if a patient has already had a heart attack, one gram of fish oil per day decreases mortality due to post-myocardial infarction arrhythmias. A recent report showed that fish oil supplementation can decrease the risk of increased hypertriglyceridemia, that is increased triglyceride levels in the blood, in patients taking isotretinoin. So potentially it may be helpful in patients taking acetretin for psoriasis. Common side effects of fish oil include nausea and a fishy odor, which can be minimized by refrigerating the product. In doses higher than 4 grams, fish oil has antiplatelet effects and could potentially increase the risk of bleeding, especially if the patient is already taking other anticoagulants. Lipid profiles should be monitored periodically whilst taking fish oil supplements since omega-3 fatty acids can increase the low density lipoprotein. Remember also that there have been several trials that have not shown significant improvement in psoriasis when fish oil was taken. Two of them were randomized controlled trials. These studies used lower doses though, only about 2 to 3 grams daily of Icosa pentaenoic acid and 1 to 2 grams daily of Docosa hexaenoic acid. So finally, what advice can we give those with psoriasis? They should be counseled to maintain a healthy body weight and avoid excess alcohol consumption. If the patient is not allergic to fish, there is evidence that eating more fatty fish, about 6 ounces a day, or taking fish oil supplements may be helpful for psoriasis. Oral supplementation is most effective if taken for 3 months or longer. 
It appears to be effective in combination with other therapies such as phototherapy, topical vitamin D analogs and oral retinoids. I hope you found this information helpful. Thank you for listening and bye.